before lobby. Hey, purple X, perp. Purple HX, thanks for the subscription. I appreciate that, man. Why is everybody saying hello, Diva? Did he say hello, stream or something? He must have done. Right, 2v2 it is. Not done one of these for a while. And I believe that last time I had Scrub Killer in a 2's lobby, he did win it pretty hard. And also, Devo won a 2's lobby, including Doomsy, ELMP, and one other. I forget who the fourth was. So, Devo, Scrub have both done very well in 2's lobbies before. Remco is a. Formerly a very high rated 2s player, he's a he's an exceptional 2s player as well. And of course Garrett needs no introduction. Probably the best 3s player in North America at the moment is Garrett. But uh, this is 2s. Garrett was the first player to reach Grand Champion in 2s. Never forget. Not the greatest save there by Debo. He's trying to put it into an unscorable position to the right of the goal, but he was not able to do so. Also, I think I just missed a sub. I'll try and catch you really quickly. Get hard art and I'm not... Straight out, out of Chrom. What on earth is that name? But thanks for the subscription, regardless. And if we've missed a goal. I appreciate that, guys. Thanks for making me miss a goal. Is the overlay still up? No. The, well, I don't need an overlay yet. It's a nice air roll shot by Garrett. He didn't even need that dodge. It was already on the net, beating out Scrub to the ball. We're all tied up. Only 13 seconds gone. Two goals. Pretty fast-paced stuff with people cheating so often in 2v2 these days, you very often just get a ton of goals. That could have been another one, just because Remco cheated and got beaten to the ball by Debo, who is actually playing the Dominus right now. He's got the Cuxer Dominus on the go, jumping for a ball, which is hitting the crossbar. That will set up Remco and Scrub for another goal. Well played by Scrub to set that so well to Remco. Got a touch in a threatening enough position that forced Debo to jump. He wasn't sure if it was going in or underneath the crossbar. One before, or you'll unsub. You're not even subbed. What kind of threat is that? So who do you guys think is going to come out of this lobby victorious? If somebody is going to win all three of their games, who do you think it's going to be? You can just type Scrub, Devil Garrett, or Remco in the chat. Who do you think is going to win this one? Uh, I think if I had to pick someone, I would say Scrub. I think Scrub is going to try hard more than anybody else in this lobby and probably win all three games. This is a fair uh, time to make a prediction as well because we are tied up. A couple of people saying Remco. A couple of people saying Devo, Remco, a lot of, De a lot of Remcos actually. Remco, Devo, Scrubs. Hardly any Garrett, so Garrett may be the least favorite to win. He is playing uh, from US. Devo also with a little bit of hyping. Not the greatest internet connection for Devo. Maybe play playing from uh, another location. And Scrub letting Devo have a lot of space here. Could be dangerous. He actually backed off a ton there, despite the fact that Remco was covering the net. It's a good read on what Garrett was doing right there. Scrub did not want to dive into that challenge too high. Garrett was just trying to play it underneath him when he did that. Oh, Devo and Garrett are a little bit in each other's faces right now, and the shot is a bit off net, but well played. Devo had to get rid of that dangerous shot regardless. First moment in this game that we've not had a million goals happen. Debo, nice recovery to set up that play. Garrett's very much in a 1v2 at the moment, has a lot of time to kill, or else he is in trouble. But well done, he stayed on the ball, did Garrett. And now he set up Debo with a high, high wall pass. Debo's going to say no thank you to that one. Just getting Remco to back off eventually does take him out of the game. But that's the beauty of 2v2, is you don't actually need to win the ball immediately with your challenge. You just need to make the other player relinquish possession of the ball, which is exactly what... Remco did right there. He forced Devo into a play. Scrub Killer comes in for the interception immediately afterwards. And of course, only when both players are out of the game will a goal result. Well played by Garrett. What a touch. Taking that ball out of danger, but it's still in a little bit of an awkward position. Devo with another good first touch. And a good recovery. Popping the ball and landing on his wheels with the same movement. I'm not sure what the shaking is about. Do you guys see this? Looks like everything's shaking. Is it Devo like wiggling his camera or something? Oh, Scrub with the airplay. Look at it. Devo just left in the dust and Scrub dribbles Garrett as well. So Devo out of position, moves up, expecting Garrett to be close behind him, but Scrub with a delayed dodge puts it to the right of the goalkeeper who was shadowing. I'm not sure. I was leaving it on that camera to see what the shake was. I don't know what that was about. You have it. So that's normal. Never seen it before bit awkward. I'm expecting this should be a difficult uh, lead now for Garrett and Devo to come back from. 
because there has been time for this game to kind of settle in. The lo Everybody's now settled into the lobby. We don't have the quick firing goals that we saw at the beginning. And Scrub and Remco are both exceptional defenders. This is a great chance for Devo though. Scrub forced to jump by Garrett, but Devo crossbars his shot. That was pretty much wide open due to Garrett's disruption on the goal line. Oh, the accidental bump, Scrub. Taking out Devo on the exit. Garrett and Devo opting for another aerial based attack. Scrubs completely underneath that. That should have been a goal. Garrett way off on the rebound. Did I see Rizzo and Zane versus a lot in Garrett? I did see one of the games, which uh, Rizzo and Zane won. Zane Jackie was playing really, really well. Also playing the Octane, which is good. I love the Octane. Best car. Octane is Bay. Especially Octane's ZSR is actually Bay. It's so good. I'm loving this new Octane. Don't know about you guys, but I just feel like so solid when I'm playing it. And also, I didn't know it. I saw uh, the updated hitbox. Uh, what do you call it, chart, on Reddit recently, and I never realized that different cars had different elevation, like uh, the bottom of the hitbox from the Octane is higher off the ground than the bottom of the Marauder, say. So despite the fact that the Marauder has a taller hitbox, the fact that the Octane is elevated higher off the ground means that it can reach a higher ball than the Marauder can without jumping. So a little bit of interesting fact right there. It's very similar but that might be why the Octane, uh, or the Marauder, just felt weird for people to play with, despite the fact that it's slightly taller than the Octane. People were like, but it doesn't feel taller. And it's because it was literally shorter when you add the elevation of the hitbox together with the hitbox size. Remco and Scrub running away with this game. Not to the surprise of uh, many of you, I'm sure, but that's a very, very hard overcommit. A lot of open net misses are happening right now. Remco and Scrub were just solidly defending their net, and then suddenly Remco goes for an extremely all-in shot. Garrett with a miss this time, a lot of misplays happening. Devo ready for the side flip shot across the net this time, but Remco on the far side, well positioned by the man from the Netherlands. He knows that that's the most likely place that Devo will clear it, and then he sticks it through the smoke behind the goalkeeper. Garrett blinded and very, very sad as they drop 6-2 to two now. Ask Devo about his dead zone. Why? Sounds like a very boring question. If he's listening, maybe he'll answer himself. Oh, that was a vicious shot from Garrett. Scrub would not have had a save there. It's going to be game for Scrub and Remco, though. My predictions so far are looking good. Remco could play spoiler, though. He's a very difficult player to play against in twos. Likes to sit back and dictate the play. He's a great player to spectate. And, oh, and they're going for a little bit of a Moy Guys play. <laughs> Somehow, Scrub gets it over the top of everybody by himself. He's had a little bit of a carry job this game has scrubbed. Nine shots and four goals. And a couple of saves as well. Really well played by him. He's gonna help Remco get the first win in the lobby. Who would you say played the best at LAN? I would say my MVP was probably Kuxer for consistency. But any all of Flipside and Devo were in the conversation. Let me just throw together a quick overlay. All right, it's going to be a little bit, a uh, little bit hodgepodge. There we go. It's nice and out of line, <laughs> as always. There we go. Scrub Rim could take game one. I wonder what combination of players we're going to get. Garrett joins immediately. Says, "Who wants to be on my team?" Remco says, "I'll be on your team, buddy." <laughs> what up, Wolfie? Everybody, look out! He's got a spanner. I mean, he's got an axe. <laughs> he's got an axe. Even it's even worse. Axes are terrifying. See, the staff have got the spanner, which is scary enough. And then you just have global mods walking about with murderous axes. Is Scrub actually going to be able to take this all the way? Yes, he is! Gets the dunk on Remco. Notice, though, Devo involved in the play, despite he not getting any points for this. Bumps Garrett out of defense. Remco, at the last second, realizes Garrett has been taking out the play. Well played, Scrub. Taking the ball all the way over the defense. And yeah, Devo, despite the fact he only got five points, he should have an assist for that play, in my opinion. Because it was all him who did the setup with the bump on Garrett. Not much Remco could do. Scrub got such a good hitbox. Oh, there we go. Remco getting a bit of a revenge this time. Comes out better off this 50 50 with Scrub. Just gets perfectly goal side through the ball. 
Yeah, global mods have got that glow. I'm so jealous. I wish my name glowed in chat. What do I think about the Legend 27? I don't know who that is, I'm afraid. I'm very sorry. And interesting to see Remco Batmobile. I don't know if I've seen much of this. Oh, a bit of a team talk at the near post there for Garrett and Remco. Hesitation on the challenge for Remco. Did allow Devo. Oh. So, are you saying that Devo's dead zone is too low and that he should fix it because it's probably making his camera shake unnecessarily? Is that what you're saying? Don't donate again, just like spam yes in the chat. <laughs> Thanks for getting my attention. That does actually make sense. I'm, I've underestimated the sensibleness of that comment regarding dead zone. Remco early up into the air for this one to make sure that he can get a good angle to catch the ball. Going for the catch and obviously the landing on the wall. Yes? Is it true? Of course you guys are all going to spam yes. Nice air roll by Garrett. Getting a beautiful half volley clear. Or not half volley, it's like the reverse of a half volley. He hit it right before it bounced, which kind of has a similar effect to hitting the ball right after it bounces in Rocket League. It doesn't get as much lift on the ball, but it does get a ton of lift. But this is a pretty pretty stalemated game right here. All of these guys are exceptional 2v2 players. Remco looking very much in control at the moment, and that's a bad sign for Scrub and Devo, because when Remco is feeling comfortable, he's a difficult player to knock off his wheels, I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say knock off his feet, but let's make let's role play that we're all cars for just a moment. Well, Scrub just goes for the straightforward play, and he's gonna set up Devo, who's actually way back. Devo could have been going for a rebound right there. I expected if anybody was gonna go up for the rebound, it would have been this man, but no, he was actually in Africa. Miles away from where he wants it to be. Oh, they're both up. We got three players up for this one. Devo's the only one who makes a connection, but he does clear it. Now they've all got to run back. Oh, Garrett stealing boost from the midfield. Won't be a problem for Scrub, though. He does have the back boost to pick up. Remco being annoying, as always. And that's a solid hit forward. Garrett ready for that one. And notice what these guys are doing is Devo comes across, makes the boost steal, and as he's doing that, Scrub moves in to collect the ball. And Devo already knows that the Scrub's going to do that, so he doesn't have to turn uh, to collect the ball himself. And he doesn't even have to look to see where Scrub is. He already knows that Scrub's going to have moved over to that side because it's just such a standard play. And Remco gets another goal off the back of another 50-50 win. Dunks on Scrub. Devo a little bit too much faith in the youngster from Scotland to come out on top in that situation. They're going to be down by two. And a lot of you guys thought Remco would be the player who would emerge from this lobby victorious. Right now, he is the favorite, with only a minute and 45 seconds left. A pretty low scoring game right here. Devo and Scrub not looking to put it together as much synergy as one might expect. They have been playing together quite a bit recently. Scrub actually facing the wrong way right there to land on his wheels, but he wanted to make sure that he would get a clear to the side more than anything else. Oh, Garrett fails his catch, but Remco is always so in control, ready for just about anything. Gonna have to be careful of Scrub messing about on the goal line. Devo starting off an air double does fake out Garrett, but Remco just moves forward at the perfect timing once again. On oh, the floor pinch to clear, this should be danger. Oh, the pinch attempt! Nice shot by Scrub and Devo. That was pretty close, actually. That's a good set by Remco over the net. Devo is ready for it, though. Remco piling on the pressure. Will Devo get another touch? Yes, of course he will. He's Devo, but only as far as Garrett, and it's gonna be another goal! Misplay by Scrub and Devo. As Devo goes out for the double touch, Scrub goes for the corner boost. Scrub is expecting something more from Devo than just a light touch. And Devo expecting that somebody was up to challenge him was just concerned about getting any touch on it at all. And yeah, what Wolfie said, if anybody's wondering what dead zone is, that's, yeah, what Wolfie said is dead zone. Like on some controllers, you have to move the joystick a certain amount before it actually registers any movement in the game. So if you decrease the dead zone, then the movement will happen sooner. Oh, Scrub just goes underneath Garrett. Fake side goes low, but they need to get more than that as Remco and, G and Garrett running away with this game. And Remco just knows if he can just keep the ball out of their net, he will have this win. Doesn't mind about getting another one. Gets a little bit of another bump from Garrett. They're not getting out of each other's way as much as they should be in defense. And a glimmer of hope, perhaps, for Scrub and Devo. There's a reasonable catch by Scrub. 
I think Garrett did what you did not expect that ball to just roll through towards him. <laughs> Who are you guys synergizing to make faces? That's pretty good. Alright, Scrub going up for an ambitious redirect attempt. So is Garrett though, this is a 2v1. Scrub and Devo have got a huge chance right here. Remco in a tough position, but he manages to get the ball over Devo. Really nice play by Remco, that was not an easy position. Scrub is on the far side, threatening. Devo is also just wiggling, which is dangerous enough as is. But Remco will take the 2-1-1-0 lead in the lobby. Garrett coming along with him to get one point next to his name. Devo actually on zero. Will he be able to increase his score before we are done here? Final rotation for these guys. Ah, uh, Devo has 0.0, .0 stiffness. That's what makes it shake, says Scrub. I don't know if that's what... I don't know if 0.0, zero camera stiffness makes it shake. I'm looking at Devo right here. The camera is definitely vibrating slightly. He forgot to take the vibrator right from underneath the seat. Yeah, I can definitely see that. Is that... Does Devo see this? If Devo sees this, this must be off-putting. Unless you just get so used to it that you don't even see it. At all. But I'd be very surprised. Anyway, we've got two potential outcomes. I'll explain this once again. Oh my goodness. Remco with a sick redirect over his own goal. Barely managing to get it out. But what scrub with... The most ridiculously lucky dunk of the lobby. Oh yeah, Remco and Scrub, every time that they have a 50-50 together, somebody wins it in monstrous fashion. That's the second time that Scrub's just completely dunked on Remco. Alright, Devo's... I'm, I'm hearing messages about Devo's controller through Scrub Killer. Scrub says his stick is slightly to the left. It's stuck slightly to the left, apparently. So it's constantly moving slightly left. Probably the camera, the right stick that looks around. I could be wrong though, I'm not 100% sure what's going on here. It just looks very, very annoying. And if Devo has to play with this, I would totally understand if he's annoyed. But I was going to ex explain the situations. We either will have a three-way tie for second place in the lobby with Remco taking unanimous first, or we will have a three-way tie for first place with Devo taking unanimous last place. And do not freak out, unanimous last place does actually happen in about half of 2v2 lobby, so it's not that crazy. And it doesn't mean that the player who does get last is bad. It just means that in this particular lobby on this given day, he has performed the worst three games in a row. Or maybe his teammates have performed the worst three games in a row. <laughs> we'll see though which one it'll be right now. Debo is not looking good. He is uh, needing Remco to step up and help him get a W on the board. Remco, of course, will want to get the third win on the board for him, him. For him, him. For himself. <laughs> That's what I meant to say. Look at that. Remco backing out of the fast aerial. He knew that he was going to fly underneath the ball if he stayed with it. So he just decided to go for a deliberate feels backflip. Scrub aims high. Remco ready for that one. So important to position yourself to the side of the goal. Remco knows that. Goes for the pass infield to Diva. Oh, Garrett read it very well, though. Infield pass is so dangerous if you present it like that. And Garrett's already up for his own rebound. He's managed to pinch it middle, but Scrub is going to respect the defending of Remco and Devo. The Vos. And the Coes. Oh, Devo was hoping and praying that that was going to come off the post, which it did. And there we go, Remco winning the race in the midfield. Takes Scrub out the game. Garrett as well. Not able to get much useful. Much of a useful touch right there. Oh, Scrub just dodged away from the ball. Devo saying he's lagging really hard, apparently. Which is unfortunate for him. Not sure if uh, he's still on his old connection. Devo's been hoping to get a good internet connection pretty soon. He said he's going to start streaming when he does. So you've all got that to look forward to. Some Devo live streams. Definitely be sure to give him a ton of love when he does live stream for the first time. I'm excited to see uh, Devo streams. I'm sure you guys are as well. Oh, Scrub's just taking it end to end over Remco and Devo right here. Not sure what happened. We might have a bit of Devo lag. I think he just... He didn't expect Scrub to be able to get another touch on it. <laughs> Nightbot automatically say no after that specific boy ABC. That would be pretty good, actually. Oh, get beaned, Remco. Send Scrub for a journey. Oh, the Scrub's back in time. Remco tried to dodge early to get across the net and meet this ball at the far post, but Scrub was just too quick. 
Well played by Garrett to pass that ball. The scrub making his hitbox as big as possible, even turning sideways to make that even more likely to win. Will I do something after this? Yeah, I'll prob I'm almost certain I'll do something after this. What that something will be is yet to be decided, but we'll see. So far, this is looking like it's going to be a three-way tie for first. And Devo, with his shaky internet today, and his new car, and his uh, wobbly controller, everything's just going wrong for Devo at once <laughs> today. It's been pretty close games all around, though. Apart from game one went pretty disgustingly in favor of Scrub and Remco after they started to uh, sit on that lead of theirs. Oh, what a save! Garrett barely keeps it off the line. That really should have been a goal, though. Remco shot very low in that aerial. Well played. Devo finds Remco, whose first touch is much more sideways than he would have wanted. Remco's doing a great job this game of just faking aerials. Oh, and he just completely mind games Garrett at the near post. Let's see what Garrett saw this entire time. He sees Remco up in the air, looks back, Remco's on the ground all of a sudden, and then Remco just waits for the ball to be strikeable. He saw Garrett pre-jumping, just fires it into the top corner. That's bringing some hope back for Devo and himself. Chat over there, right? It's been broken actually all day. Sorry about that, buddy. Garrett barely getting a touch on that. He's still hanging strong in defense, and he's going to be rewarded. Well intercepted by Garrett. Scrub and Remco, or Devo and Remco, rather. A little bit too all-in. I don't feel like this was the moment to move forward with two people. They are still a minute and five seconds. There is still a minute and five seconds in this game. They did not need to all-in on that one play. And that could come back to haunt them. If they score one more goal, they're going to be regretting that overcommit. I'm not sure, what do you guys think about Batmobile Remco? I've always been a fan of Octane Remco myself, because I'm a fan of pretty much anybody who plays the Octane. But uh, Batmobile Remco has been playing okay. Oh, Devo can do nothing but own goal this. Batmobile Remco beans it. It's a good touch by Gary. He got a second touch, made the ball as awkward as possible for Remco, and then Scrub's just waiting on the far post to dunk on Devo's attempted clear across the goal, turns his attempted clear into an own goal. This is looking like it's going to be the three-way tie for first place that we talked about. Remco not able to do enough to help Devo get a first W on the board. And that means that a lot of us were right, because I did ask who did you guys think was going to win the lobby. And if three people win the lobby, then that probably means three, time, three times or two and a half times more of us are right than would have been otherwise. What a save! Scrub pre-jumping Remco's aerial to get that block. The pass from Devo was a good one. Oh, and the angle shot, nicely done by Devo. A glimmer of hope for the blue team. It's a great recovery by Devo. He manages to pop the ball, land in his wheels, and get the angle shot with an early dodge to reposition. Does anyone use Takumi in the pro level? I believe not. He has a solid kickoff for Scrub and Devo. Remco's actually backed off. This is probably game. He needs to show more, more aggression given the scoreline. Scrub's just going to play this safely. Oh, but Remco with the dunk from the ceiling! Can he do it? Garrett saves it so close. Remco with the ceiling dunk on Scrub Killer. And that's going to do it. Devo and Remco drop game three. And that means we have the three way tie for first place, and poor Devo takes the last. But GG's. Skyline is used to give me. I suppose, yeah, you're right. Skyline is used to give me a pro level. GG's, boys. Remco is keen for more. We might replace Scrub and do another lobby.